Well, my life is different than most people's. When I'm cooking, I have to um, wear a timer around my neck, and it's kind of kind of humorous looking, but um, I have to do that so I don't set my kitchen on fire. And I buy a lot of fruits and vegetables pre-chopped, even some meats. Um, but that's just because I still, I have a bilateral hand impairment. My right hand still shakes and I don't really like blood in my salad. I don't believe that things happen for a reason. I know a lot of people do, and that's okay. But I believe in free will, like that we have a choice in what we do and how we live our lives. And I just don't have the luxury of having time to worry about why. Recovering from a traumatic brain injury requires 36 hours a day. I just don't have time for pity parties. I mean, I'm sure having a few would be nice, but they're just counterproductive. I'll begin by telling you what happened to me 23 years ago. We hit a telephone pole and I was knocked unconscious on the dashboard. The first sentence I wrote after my traumatic brain injury was, I'm lost in my mind. In November of 2014, Modern History Press published my memoir, Lost in My Mind, Recovering from Traumatic Brain Injury, or TBI. These TBI survivors needed a voice. I feel a little bit holier than thou, you know, saying I had to be the voice. You know, I may talk slow and I may mumble at times, but you know, I can talk. A lot of victims of TBI can't. Personally, I never gave up hoping for a full recovery. Hope is my message. Never give up your fight. I'm asking for your help.